So now it is Pit and Mario. I'm going to be freaking Pit for once in my life. It's going to be pretty freaking awesome. So hello, everybody, and welcome back to another awesome episode of Super Smash Brothers Brawl Subspace Emissary. I'm at Station Times. In the last episode, we basically did the first few levels of this area, and now we're in the Sky World and with Mario, and we have to save this amazing place from a horrible death and try to save freaking Zelda, even though she was like the best character in that entire group of people. But she got captured by freaking Wario for some reason. I'm like, are you serious? Get captured by Wario, the slowest character ever created by man? I don't even know, man. Freaking Wario. The evilest evil of all time, but he is still trying to take control of everybody else. Like, that, that, that doesn't make any sense, dude, to me at all. So, before we get on with this episode, don't forget to leave a like and help the channel and the series so much. I'd really appreciate it. So, let's continue on. And kill this guy with the boomerang, dude. He can't boomerang us anymore because he's dead. That's how things work in this world. You can't stop this. You can't stop my flow. We're going to get through. Oh, it's blocked off. Come oh, my God. What the frick? Well, let's go right in and take on this door. Where does this lead to? Oh, we got a, a piece of paper. My, my favorite. I love pieces of paper. They're very cool, man. Pieces of paper my favorite are my favorite pages dude come on that's not good so let's continue going up this vertical scrolling level and we can come up here and do some things and get nothing great yay we got a trophy that doesn't matter <laughs> let's move on <laughs> this would be great dude here we go going right back in again taking on some other fantastical things it should be great and grand but i'm pretty sure we can get past this as long as this Random boomerang fella does not try to wreck our faces too much. But uh, just like before, we do have another character that we can use if it dies twice. So it's not too difficult whatsoever. Also, since we're on normal mode, it's not that bad. But I want to play it in normal mode just so it wouldn't be too difficult to show off the story and stuff like that. But I, I also wanted to have a good time playing this as well, which I already am, dude. I have been very, very excited to play this game for a very long time now. And I have finally the opportunity to do so. So I'm so glad I'm playing this right now. So let's continue on. And go over to this zoom pad. Yeah, zoom pads for everybody. Go right into the gold door. What does this mean? Let's find out. And we cleared the stage. We got some barrels of Freezy, Pelly, and Phyllis. Phyllis, what the heck are you doing in this game, dude? Ha, <laughs> Cupid Kirby from Kirby and the Amazing Mirror. Great stuff, man. Great times in this place. And Mario joined our team. Wow, the new Mario, man. That's pretty cool. Same with Pit. Awesome, dude. So let's go back into the Sea of Clouds and take on this next journey of ours. Okay, well, I guess I'm going to be picking either Peach or uh, Kirby, so I'm going to be picking Kirby first, and then Peach, so then we can move on again and hopefully not die with Kirby, so uh, we'll ha not have too much of a trouble. Wow, words are hard sometimes, guys. I'm truly sorry about that, but let's continue on. We're going to go over to the top of the ship, which serves a purpose with uh, Fox McCloud. He's a very cool guy, but there's no enemies up here. It's probably because Fox is pretty much a cool guy. Why did they make us pick in the first place if all we did was walk to the right side? Alright. That was awkward, but now we're in this sea of clouds with Kirby. And not Pit, even though this is where freaking Pit resides. Like, Kirby, now it's your turn to climb down the clouds and hopefully figure out what you're doing with your life in the future of time. It's a problem that future Kirby will have to deal with later on, but whatever. So there we go. Let's jump down, throw this fan at this guy. He'll never live again. I'm sorry, buddy. I did not mean to kill you like that, but 
It's a desperate measure. What is this? Uh, oh, okay, that's another life that we, we could have gotten. So now we have three lives that we can do before Peach comes out. And she'll have to freaking waste her life trying to kill everybody that killed Kirby for some reason. Just like, whatever, man. So here we go. Let's kill this Toto. Toto, let's go back to Kansas. What is, what is this? Oh, that was cool. It was like a freaking disc. It's like a super disc or something like that. It's pretty awesome. Get on my face, fish. Dang it, dude. Come on. Trying to freaking fish eye me. That's not freaking cool. Get out of here. Thank you. We don't, so we only have 14% damage to Kirby so far. So we should be okay for the next coming up battle of the Super Smash Brothers characters. So, oh my gosh. Dude, give me your ice cream. He has ice cream, right? Is that... Okay, I'm pretty sure that was ice cream. That's freaking awesome. <laughs> so now we have 3% because when we have food, we will replenish our health, which is kind of obvious. You know, when you're freaking hungry, you're just like, I want food in my tummy now. And if you don't get it, you're kind of mad. But then when you do get it, you're like, oh, that was so good. And then you can rest easy, go to sleep a little bit, put your head up, take off your shoes, and uh, live a longer life. But on some cases, then food isn't about eating. It's about living and trying to uh, survive in this world because that's what the cavemen used to do for some reason oh well of course for some reason they were cavemen they didn't have anything to do but eat and try to survive whatever <laughs> oh my gosh guys can you please die thank you thank you mr spark oh my gosh no oh my that was okay is there anybody over there hello oh no there's not one there's no one over here Oh, hello, Mr. Keys. <gasps> Dude, is that the Keyblade? No, it's not a freaking Keyblade. Are you serious, Mr. Might? Get out of here, guys. Why are you Why are you guys trying to kill me, man? That's not cool. Okay, they're all dead to me. Get can you please stop, Mr. Might? Thank you. Okay, there's a little lock over here that we can get. Let's actually look at that real quick. Hello, Mr. Man. We got a Torchic trophy. Wow. That's some great stuff right there. Dude, that is very rare. I'm going to sell the black market for $300. On the virtual black market, which makes total sense, right? Yeah, listen to me, okay? I know what I'm talking about. Not really, okay? I don't know the black market situation of freaking Super Smash Brothers Brawl, okay? Oh my gosh, now we have a freaking hammer! Hammer time, everyone! Great time to be alive today! Oh my, really? Seriously, man? I was just trying to be your friend, Mr. Rock. Dude, why did, why did the rock freaking mess me up? Dude, that's not nice. He probably smelled what I was cooking or something. Oh, okay, so now we have Starman powers. Where do we freaking go? Oh, that, that was stupid. We, we could have died there immediately. That would have been awful. Oh my gosh, stop it, Mr. Freaking Sparky Spark Spike Spikes, guys. I don't, I don't like this, dude. Oh, freak, you freaking Glunder. Stop with your crap. I don't like this. Okay, get out of here. One more Glunder to go, I guess. Boom. He's out of my mind, out of my life forever. Now we can take on some more fish. <laughs> more fish, more problems. That's how things work in this world, apparently. Watch it. Oh, dear God. I'm sorry, Mr. Boulder. Just knock it off, dude. It's not It's not that bad, dude. Mr. Rock, I know your life is kind of hard. Oh, I know your life is kind of hard right now. Just please try to calm down. This, it's not nice to be all cranky and crap. Just live life like... It's your last day to be alive. <laughs> that's, that's, oh, we almost died there. That would have been bad. Kirby's little epic yarn stuff would have died immediately. But guess what? We're still alive. We can take on this guy once more. And please don't die. No, dang it. We died. That was the first death, everybody. Welcome. Oh, we have Peach now? Oh, okay. Well, ha we were almost done with this level too. Gosh, dang it. Yeah, we got a Torchic Trophy, a young cricket from WarioWare Smooth Moves. We also got a big switch. Wow, that's some great stuff right there. All right, so guys, in the next episode, we will take on the draw the, the drongle. <laughs> we will take on the jungle. If you like this video, don't forget to leave a like and help with the channel and the series so much. I really appreciate it. So I'm going to take some time. Thank you all so much for watching, and I'll see you all in the next one.